I would have gave her the keys and the code. <laughs> Here's how you get up in here. All right, let me let, let me let me give you the keys and the code. Uh, this particular Karen wants a refund. Uh, the the Burger King is on fire. The Burger King is burning down. Okay, <laughs> all of the employees are out of the facility because it is burning to the ground. She pulls up because she's demanding a <laughs> refund. Let this be a lesson of what not to do when a building is on fire. One woman was visiting a Burger King drive through when the building started burning. Fire alarms blaring, okay? The Burger King employees evacuated. Why? Because they're smart. She's not. All of a sudden, the woman in red car pulls up to the Burger King restaurant window and demands a refund. On her Burger King food, and then she insults everybody. Uh, she goes on to berate them, saying, "This is why you only make thirteen dollars an hour." One employee shouts back, "We only make ten. <laughs> <laughs> but still, you're not getting a refund. Uh, we bring this up often because there's this ugly classism in America, where there are, and it really permeates in humanity, but it's really pronounced in America, where there are individuals. Who feel as if you can just talk down to people <laughs> who are in service industries. And remember, what you make, how much money you have, your, your education, your position at a workplace, that doesn't define you. That doesn't make you decent. That doesn't make you a person of value, of moral character, of integrity. None of that does. But there's a status class. In this country of individuals like this Karen, who as soon as something doesn't go the way they want it to go, they don't care that the building's on fire. They're not concerned if somebody's burning up. They don't give a damn about what inconvenience is taking place for others in that moment. She wants her five dollars back for her. What is it? What is it now? Uh, at Burger King? I don't know. I've been in Burger King so long. Maria, what are your thoughts? You mean you you don't miss that charbroiled? Charbroiled, taste? that's what it is. No, I, I don't. I think that was uh, chemically induced. It uh, in anyway. <laughs> so I guess you know what's hard for me when I see these videos um, is it's a side of this country again yeah. that I'm just like I. You know, I and people think people in New York are crazy. No, <laughs> in New York, we would not be going into a burning building to get a refund on Burger King. So I'm just saying, I it makes me very sad. The whole idea that she would be coming back to try to get that amount of money returned, and then that she would be yelling at the employees and insulting them. Yeah, and you're right. One of the things we don't talk about in this country is class, but it is a way in which we are so divided. And all of the messaging around class That's right. is that if you are of a, any kind of class that is not the super rich, there is something wrong with you and you are less than a human being. So this is just a, a sad reminder, Rashad. I mean, I'm laughing, but I'm also really sad. Well, you have to laugh not to cry at much of this stuff.